A shift of focus now to the brave men and women who serve our country in conflicts around the world. A new documentary series airing Monday nights on the relaunched American Heroes Channel, formerly known as the Military Channel, brings us the gripping story straight from the battlefield of the real-life band of brothers and sisters who fight in our wars. My radio is disabled. My gunner and my driver both had concussions. I get out of the vehicle, and now I'm on the ground, evacuating the casualties out of the vehicle and trying to take command and control of what was now in the middle of a firefight. Incredible. Joining me now, Perfecto Chanchez, the man you were just hearing. He's an Iraq War veteran who's part of the team that helped capture Ramadi in 2006. Perfecto, you know I've been waiting to talk to yes. you many weeks now. And since I ran into you, we were in Florida, yep. and um, the channel was launched, American Heroes Channel, and your story was a part of that. Um, what compelled you to participate in this? I mean, you're living and reliving some hard memories. You lost people close to you in that battle. Yes, and, and that's a very fair question. And I think the first thing I want to say, it's, it, it, it's, it's not my story. I had a hard time whether to decide to do it or not, but I wanted to do it because it's about the men that I served with. And it's, I wanted to tell their stories for them and for their families. I think it's an important story to be told as well. Six men in your company um, would fall in the battle in Ramadi, uh, two of them in your platoon. Mm -hmm. And it is, as you point out, their story, but it is also yours. How did it feel? to relive this for all of us to hear. Yeah, and I think, I mean, something that was so special and so, um, so, so poignant in the time in my life, it's, I think it's important to acknowledge those memories. And it's something that's a really big part of who I am as a person today. And I'm very proud of it at the end of the day. I mean, it's something that was very historic, um, very important um, in that time in history. And Yes, it's emotional, but it's something that I can proudly say that I, I, I did with, um, with all of my efforts, and I'm, and I'm, I'm happy to be here. And, and I am happy that you brought your story, especially because it involves the Iraq War. Mm -hmm. You know, you bring it up at a dinner table, and you're going to have various yeah. opinions, but I think, hopefully, the overwhelming gratitude goes toward people like yourself, who gave up so much for this country mm -hmm. during that war. And it's not, of course, the only battle that's looked at. I want to play a clip from uh, the show that's airing tonight. It's a battle, battle for sugar loaf uh, in Okinawa. Let's play a clip of that. The battle for sugar loaf hill, of course, is in the annals of the history of the Marine Corps is one of the big battles along with Bella Wood and Chosin Reservoir and so many other battles. We're on a page of that history, and uh, a deserving page. A deserving page, indeed. I, the fact that this is called Against the Odds, mm -hmm. you know, when you look at your life today and what you were able to survive, how has that shaped where you are as a man now? Well, I think leaving the military is one of the hardest decisions, personal decisions I've ever had to make. And one thing I promised uh, the men that I served next to is that I would live every day in their honor and I now carry that let's just call it responsibility to make everything that I do after my time in Ramadi mean something and I want to make it mean something so I never forget that experience I never forget them I thank them for for teaching me for 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 protecting me and that's something that I want to continue to live in every day that I have on this earth to be a good person so well, you know, you're bringing me tears to my eyes again. Every time I've seen him, thank you so much. You're thank a great you, guy. Thank you. Ah, sorry, Against the Odds airs Mondays at 10 p.m. Eastern. It is a celebration of our heroes on American Hero Channel. We'll be right back.